Sylvain. Jay, and today I'm here with my TBR for January 2020. Cannot believe that it's 2020. If you are new to my channel, then you don't know this, but my mom always picks up my TBR. It's her like fun way to be a part of my channel. So she chose six books this time around. So without further ado, let us get started. <sighs> So like I said, my mom always picks my TBR and she always has some weird theme to go along with it. So this month, since it is January, she chose to make it your New Year's resolutions. So the first book she chose was Sleeping Giants by Sylvain Nouvelle and this is for the resolution Sleep More. I don't know that much about this book other than it's like a sci-fi book and there's like a giant hand in the sky or something. But Brit really likes this book, so I'm hoping that I do. I know that it's on audiobook, and the audiobook is highly recommended, so I'm probably going to end up listening to it on the audiobook. The next one she chose is The Woman Who Ran. This is by Sam Baker, and this is for the resolution Get In Shape or Exercise More, hence the ran. All I know about this one is that it is a thriller about a woman who can't remember her past, but then her past comes back to find her. Next one she chose was Sometimes I Lie by Alice Feeney, and this is for the resolution Stop Lying As Much. <laughs> Again, don't know that much about this one other than it is a thriller. I know that it is also an audiobook. It's very short, so it should be a pretty quick read. I believe it's about a girl who like wakes up in a coma or something and she like doesn't remember things. I don't know. It says, my name is Amber Reynolds. There are three things you should know about me. I'm in a coma. My husband doesn't love me anymore. Sometimes I lie. I'm intrigued. I believe that this was on my like most anticipated releases when it first came out, but I never read it. So why not read it for a New Year's resolution, TBR? Next, she chose Love at First Like by Hannah Oristein, and this is for the New Year's resolution Fall in Love. I've heard very negative things about this book. It's about this girl who, like, fakes a relationship online or something like that. It fakes a marriage. I don't know, but Chelsea from Chelsea Dolling Reads read this and really hated it, so I don't have the highest hopes for it. But here we are. Next is Goodbye From Nowhere. This is by Sarah Zar, and this is for the New Year's resolution Travel More because there's a little car there, so therefore that is traveling. I'm pretty sure that this has nothing to do with traveling. I'm pretty sure it's about a guy whose mom is having an affair and he finds out about it, tells his dad, and his dad already knows about it and like wants him to keep it secret. And his whole world like implodes because of it and he has to decide what he's gonna do. So really nothing to do with travel, but there's a car, so travel. And then the final book that she chose was Small Town Hearts by Lily Vale. This is supposed to be for the resolution Eat Better, which I think is funny because it has a piece of pie on it and that's not exactly, you know, healthier, but probably better because it tastes better. But this follows a girl named Babe who is trying not to fall in love with a boy named Levi who is only in her town for the summer. And that's all I really know about it. I haven't really heard anybody talk about this book. It's an arc from like a long time ago. It came out March 2019, so from a while ago and I never picked it up, so here's where I'm picking it up. Alright everybody, so that was the TBR that my mom chose for January 2020. Let me know down below if you have read any of these books and what you thought of them, and I will see you all in my next video. Goodbye!